All right, good morning, church. Today we have the first of our two baptisms. Gabriel Luca is going to be baptized today. And uh, Gabriel is 12. And he's not only getting baptized today and professing his faith in Jesus and in his life, death, and resurrection, he also happens to be my nephew. So this is a very special occasion. I was teasing Gabriel before about getting ready to sing his special song. He didn't know that he had to sing a special item. So are you ready, Gabriel? No. <laughs> He's not ready to sing, but he is ready to serve Jesus. And it's a thrill today to see Gabriel, who's, who's just really, in many ways, beginning his life, 12 years young, not even yet a teenager, and then Ken, who will be baptized, who is approaching 70. So it's very thrilling to see people at either end of the spectrum of their life making this decision. And I think it's a great lesson for us that the invitation that Jesus extended, follow me, is an invitation that is irrespective of age, or gender, or nationality, or race. Can you say amen? Amen. And today Gabriel has accepted that invitation. So I'm going to have a prayer with Gabriel, and then we'll baptize him. Father in heaven, today Gabriel is making a decision, as is Ken, to put his faith totally in the life, death, and resurrection of Jesus. And Father, today the prayer of my heart as an uncle, as a friend, and also as a pastor, is that Gabriel will live a life of integrity, a life of responsibility and a life of leaning totally on the righteousness of Jesus. Father, may he realize that he not only has a great earthly father in Christiana and a beautiful mother, Felicia, as well, but especially that he has an earthly father, that you are looking out for him with tender regard and compassion and care. And so, Father, even though Gabriel is yet a young man, the operative word here is not young, but man. He is a man. And today he is saying by going through with the decision to be baptized, that he wants to be a man after your own heart. And so, Father, though he may be young in years, may he be mighty in strength, in the integrity of his character, and may he grow up to be everything that he was created to be. May he be the best version of himself as he leans totally on the righteousness of Jesus. In his name we pray. Gabriel, because you love the Lord Jesus, and more importantly, because he loves you. It's my privilege as a minister of the gospel and as your uncle to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. 